All right, hey guys, here we are, Wolf Creek Hole 7, par 4. And again, I kind of mentioned this last time, you know, I, I really don't care if I keep this in the fairway too much. It's, it's actually a little bit easier for me to play a rough shot on this because I have yellow jacket. So if you don't have yellow jacket on, you know, may not be worth it. I didn't even mean to keep that cruise R on. That was... But uh, nevertheless, we should be okay. Let's see if this stays in the fairway. And you can see, since my bounces were more off of the downslope and more in like the flats, I hold the fairway. Otherwise, I'll roll through and go to the rough. But here you can see we got a headwind anyway. So not too worried about this one. I'll be able to easily stop this one. First off, I'll typically try to figure out, well, how far am I? I'm about half club. So with that being said, we're going to play this pretty tight overall. Uh, the wind will help it to collapse down. At half club, I'm not going to go more than a ring, ring and a half here. Let's just take a look at what that looks like. You can see he has yellow jacket as well, so he'll be able to stop it pretty well. You can see mine's just rolling through. And as your clubs develop you and, and you can see more of that guide, you'll know. Like, I would know that that was going to roll through if I had more guide. But, you know, you have to consider, you know, well, I'm landing on an upslope. So, you know, I'm just trying to think of, like, how is it going to react, especially into the headwind and everything. Because headwind, tailwind's going to change everything. And once we get to the later tours and you can see a little bit more of the ball guide, um, it'll be a lot easier to master this game, and that's when I'll show you guys some of those more advanced concepts. And here, we haven't seen this one yet, so I'm glad this one came up. This is a very easy, very easy shootout. The only thing I do here is crank it. The only way I play it. We know it's not going to run out very much at all. So you can see with how tight I am to the hole, I'm only going to play just a little bit more than a half ring here so right about to where that white is right now just a here more than that Let's see if my opponent gets his ultimate looks like he probably did <clears throat> let's just see how mine rolls out Ugh. so you can see doesn't really go forward much easy to get that one in there tight pick up an easy win depending on you know how well your opponent plays wins stuff like that so you can see very straightforward hole um, that's really the only way to play it so I'll typically do that into a headwind you know might need to just make a little bit of a modification on the spin in the event that you can't get it that deep you might need to take off a bar or two but uh, other than that always play that one that way so good luck there I'll see you guys on the next one